Hi, it's Miss Sarah coming to you through a video. Um, this is called Screencastify video. Let me know how you like this format um, because if you like it, I'll continue more with it. Um, let me know how the audio is and how well you can navigate through the assignment um, by watching this video of me uh, demonstrating it. So what I was thinking right now, I'm working on a MacBook Air and I'm going to go to Google Classroom and just show you uh, the last assignment that I had posted. So I don't know. Let's take a look in Mr. Mark's class. So we'll go to classwork and then you're going to find the photography section topic. See the heading? Photography, Miss Sarah Signorelli. Okay. I think I'm going to look at this one here. I can photo a friend. This is due May 15th. And when you click on it, it opens up here. Now, I'm signed in as myself right now, so it may look a little different for you uh, since you're a student and I'm a teacher, but I think uh, basically it's enough information for you. You um, can click on View Assignment, and here you have, there'll be instructions. The page is going to look like this here. So the learning target is I can photo a friend. And then it says, watch the video, complete the assignment in video description, complete Google form, turn in assignment. Okay, so here's the video. You're going to watch the video and see if um, you can take a photo of a friend. Now, uh, bear in mind that it is still uh, a quarantine, a shelter in. So consider, you know, social distancing and all those measures. Um, but I'm thinking that maybe there is someone in the house with you already uh, who you live with and you can use that person. Um, now, this is a Google form. So if you click on that after, um, you know, you complete the assignment, you can fill in. It says photography assessment. Com please complete this form and turn in the assignment. That's a big important thing to note. Turn in assignment. I think a lot of students have not turned in their assignments to me. Um, also, you know, I'm getting in a lot of turned in uh, assignments with no work. So this is a form that reassures you have um, uh, that you have, you know, completed some work and you have proof of work. Okay, sorry, I'm lose. I'm getting lost in this form here. I hope it's. Um, not too difficult for you to use. Uh, please provide me with some feedback. Again, um, I need to know how I can best support you and your needs. Um, okay, so you know, you write in your name, you put in your email. Um, it says quiz questions. I would like to know how you like the assignments to better suit your needs. How did you like the video? This is one point. Great, too long, not interested, difficult. What would you like to learn about this month? Continue with what we're doing. been doing. I want to have a class exhibit of my photos. How to use your device in order to complete the required assignments. Okay, now upload a file here that relates to the assignment topic. Only one of your best photos that you have taken, please. Add file. So here is um, where you, the way that you can upload the um, photograph that you created by watching the video assignment. So you're going to go to select files from your device and then you have to find your photo. You know, oftentimes um, the photos will be stored like in the desktop. Um, sometimes what I do, um, I'll show you that in a minute here. What I do is um, I use, I can't see it, I use a photo booth um, application. Let me go into Finder, I'll open it that way. And um, Applications. You see Photo Booth. 
I see iMovie. Where is that photo booth? Here it is right here. I use photo booth. This is a question that um, my student, El Mohammed, continues to ask me. He's having trouble figuring out how to take a photo on his MacBook. Well, here it is, El Mohammed. Um, you go to photo booth, you take a picture. Okay, and then um, usually what I do is I hit the keyboard uh, command shift four, and then this little cropping tool shows up and I crop the image that I just created. Um, oops, I'm going, uh, I just hit escape to get rid of that. Look, I want to do, ah! <laughs> too funny. Oh my goodness. You know what? I'm going to take a nice screenshot of that. So I hit shift command four. <laughs> Okay, um, so now I have that a screenshot of this. We'll go with this photo, huh? Um, let's go back to the classroom. That is so funny. Okay, and then um, you can select files from your device. You go to the desktop. The screenshot was the last one that I made there. There I am. You hit OK. And you hit Upload. And then you hit, uh, if you want, send me a copy of my responses if you want to receive an email of all of this um then you would hit this button here to move it over and then you hit submit so this is a great um piece of student work evidence i really need you to turn in work to me i need to see photographs that you have taken um i you know i don't want to see any more uh copying of images that you find on the internet use that photo booth um, let's take a look here. Now, one other important thing to note, uh, and this is, I think, the last thing that I'm going to say, um, because, you know, I don't want to take too much of your time. I want this to be fun, uh, very, you know, informative and useful to you. So, um, in order for me to really do that, I need you to, um, place some comments in this box here. A lot of, uh, students have been sending me private comments, which is great, but I really want to, um, you know, bring it to the next level and have all of the class involved in the communication and discussion of these assignments you know so on this page um it says class comments okay add comments in here tell me you know some feedback um talk to your classmates um you know really uh i would like anything even just a high um to begin and let's start to engage with one another and build you know our class and community back up um thank you so much for for your time and um i will see you you know the next lesson